What is up everyone, my name is FM Sorcerer, and I know what you guys are thinking. FM, you only upload when there is a new update, you headass. Now, first of all, you might be right. And second of all, I am aware that I have not uploaded in a while, but I've been very, very busy with some college things and some life things. I'm not gonna lie, life's been hard, but we're just gonna skip past that because you know what? Wiz has released the latest test realm and uh, it, it's gonna be pretty interesting. Uh, so what we're gonna be doing in this video is reading the notes and I'm also going to be going on to the test realm. I actually already have it loaded up and we're going to look at some of these new things that they've added to the game yeah all right so i have the notes up right now so let's go on ahead and start now we all know that there is going to be a uh, or that there is in this update a uh, revamp of wizard city continuing what they already started last a uh, summer summer ray I, I summer ray summer you guys know she makes vids with like rice gums I, I don't know why i'm doing this let's i don't really know what else to expect for this update so let's go on ahead and figure it out all right so highlights wizards there is someone outside of the window cleaning the glass i guys i am in my quiet lounge in my, right now because reason roommates and reason okay um so highlights wizard city revamp continues except crab alley okay uh i can honestly see that because crab alley is kind of i think the graphics are kind of up to up there so i don't think it really matters a seventh character slot has been added to the crown shop finally there is a seventh character slot a lot of people have wanted that for a while myself included um but it says crown shop so you're gonna have to this king's house still got you're gonna have to fess up bro especially if you're poor they want all the joints new treasure card vault and display can hold up to a thousand treasure cards thank you this is something i have wanted for a while a treasure card vault basically meaning you can put your treasure cards in there so you can hold more treasure cards and also i'm hoping that this means it's like a bank where you can move it between different characters but if not then that kind of is a missed opportunity but it's all good new skeleton key bosses level one level 20 spirit of ignorance who's man's level 130 aether elemental okay that's pretty interesting so hopefully they drop some good stuff i don't really know i, I mean i know the skeleton bosses drop some good stuff every now and then but i'm not really sure about all that chief new monstrology creatures fun new decathlon school themed events what the who's what decathlon <laughs> what the hell brother loot drop elixirs will now go to your backpack instead of being automatic i don't even know what a freaking loot drop a wizard ui scaling and windowed full screen improvements now with windowed borderless mode streamers can now easily tap out of the game streamers hold up without disrupting stream quality oh my god that is actually kind of lit but it says these are the highlights i'm not gonna lie to you guys for highlights of the update that stuff seems a little bit dry I'm not sure but I mean let's just let's just continue reading these notes because you never really know as you can see here guys uh, Wizard City has is continuing to get revamped Firecat Alley the new Firecat Alley right there I'm pretty sure you guys already heard a lot about that so we'll check that out seventh character slot uh, you've asked we've listened all right so it's an elixir basically they're not telling you how much it is I, I don't think that's a coincidence okay all right once you purchase the seventh character slot currently found at the bottom of the elixirs tab you log out and go to character select okay i know how to play this game i am a wizard even more about elixirs if you can't get to your spring cleaning yet never okay i don't think this is stuff that anybody cares about all right whatever yada yada uh so you think you can you can dance there's a new housing game town what okay brother sparkle and shine we've now given you the ability to customize your Hey, yo, I think we're gonna need to play that that music from the intro. Yes, please. Guys, if you aren't aware, this is something that I and a lot of people have been wanting for a while. So this is actually kind of lit. It's basically being able to customize your wizard's aura, but it's saying teleport particles. So it's not like something that stays all the time, but this is still pretty cool. They've been listening. I made a video on this. Hey, King's Isle, if you took it, if, if you took inspiration, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I wouldn't have a problem if you cut me a check for uh, like $60,000. Uh, anyways, you can change this option under gameplay three in the settings menu. Let's get 
get it my dude more skeleton key fights treasure trove all right this is pretty much all that they already mentioned um yeah more to come next week we'll be launching the test of our first decathlon event i'm interested in this because i don't know what the what this is supposed to be stay tuned for more information on that but for now prepare your best decks and treasure cards and get ready to ascend the tower this is interesting i don't know if this is a dungeon i don't think it's a dungeon i feel like it's like some kind of like pvp type thing but then i don't i don't know it's I, decks and treasure cards what i don't De dex hex oh are we having hex i hey man yo king zong you better tell these people to be using tower shields out here i'm just saying protection it matters but let's just go ahead and jump into all of this okay we've already read all these notes and we have not played the game yet so uh, let's go ahead and switch to the other side oh my god brother we're on whiz all right guys so one thing that's interesting to note is that there is now an elixir tab in the backpack so more small things that no one asks for but that's cool all right so whoo, brother yo this is actually really lit yo yo this is really lit this is the new trident avenue why did i open my character slot i've not been on this game in a while my god i suck anyways this is the new trident avenue and it reminds me a lot of the death school from the uh summer update last year and i actually really like you know what i'm seeing so far this is my first time seeing this with you guys so this is actually pretty cool uh, everything here looks pretty smooth i honestly think and i think i saw somebody saying this and i think they're right like I think the darker areas like in the game look better with updated graphics you know like when you really think about it the death school looked really nice last time ravenwood's a little gloomy so i guess you know ravenwood looked all right but yeah like this looks pretty freaking litastic and you know obviously trying avenue i mean it was kind of gloomy before but they now they really want you they want you to know when you walk right in be like yo this place is gloomy okay let's get so hey man they're really stressing the fact uh i know i'm probably missing a lot of parts actually i think i missed a street but i mean you guys get the gist i'm um, just really trying to show you all what the what the basis of the where am i going with this sentence but um yeah this is actually pretty lit uh hope you guys are enjoying this video so far if you are you might want to scroll your mouse and or finger depending on what device you're using or this could be the year 3016 okay i i don't know man turn the nine upside down it's a six now <laughs> yeah okay and just, just scroll it and tap that like button okay let's try to get this vid to 100 likes and if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe and let's go into the haunted cave because um i'm dark so yeah let's get oh 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 my god whoa whoa i'm sinking it's dark everything's dark help help me i'm sinking oh my god oh my glorious whiz head syndrome oh my god this is actually really lit yo i like this even better look at the sky bro look at the sky dude look at the <laughs> like stoops <laughs> like scoops look at the sky dude yo this is actually really lit oh my god this is actually really cool bro i i'm just saying dude i'm just saying like fire is my favorite school i am like i'm just a lit person so like of course in real life i just attach myself to things that are I'm just saying, I really have liked the darker stuff that they do in Wiz ever since they've been doing the graphics updates, bro. Like, I might have to switch to death. <laughs> it's like, no, nah, they suck at peeve, but you know what I'm saying, you know. Um, yeah, this is really cool. Haven't even gone to Firecat Alley yet, knowing how much I love fire. Oh my god, bro. Like, I'm gonna start chilling here and making vids all the time, bro. This is crazy. Dude, they really need to make Wizard City free so that people can actually see this. This is really, really cool. And the people who make, like, who design this stuff, they deserve some raises. <laughs> they deserve some raises. All right, let's go in ahead and uh, let's go to let's go to Firecat Alley. Dude. You know what your dumbass does when you get pulled into a fight and you don't have any cards? Yeet! Okay, we're in Firecat Alley now, and yo, this looks pretty freaking fire from what i'm seeing already yo this guy actually really reminds me of dragon spire 
Uh, ooh, they got the little embers coming out. I see you, Kings. Oh, I see you. This is really cool, guys. This is really cool. I mean, as much as people ride on the updates for only, you know, doing like one thing, myself included, like only updating like one thing, like the graphics or whatever, still got to appreciate this. You know, this is something that people had been asking for for a long time, you know, and they are answering, you know, our, our fate or our don't, I don't know the word, but you know what I'm saying? Whoever you know, does these updates really, really deserves, you know, a raise or just some recognition because this is really, really cool. You know, I like this a lot and I think it's going to stand the test of time. You know, like people, we're going to look back at this in like two years and be like, yo, I really appreciate that they did that. You know, Wizard City glue up, bruh. Her you versus the guy she tells you not to worry about. All right. Firecat Alley looks really cool. I'm still going to have to say that the Haunted Cave and Trident Avenue are number one and two for me. But this is definitely number three. Over, all right. Because you already know I'm about my fire shiz. So, um, so yeah. Let's go on ahead and go to Cyclops Lane. And uh, I think we're going to wrap up this video because I don't really think there's anything else to check out at the moment. I'm really interested to find out what that... De uh, my, my ass keeps getting lost. Where am I going? I'm really interested to check out that Decalathon thing because I don't know what that is and i'm i'm just i'm curious okay i really want to know what that is it could be something you know game changing could add a new hobby to whiz for us or it could just be stupid like monstrology but you know i, I don't know dude i don't know yeah guys like i said make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel uh all those fresh things all right guys we are finally in Cyclops Lane, and honestly, I really like what I'm seeing just in these first few, you know, seconds. Uh, oh, actually, Cyclops Lane has its own haunted cave, doesn't it? We are gonna have to check that out. See if it, see if it compares to the other haunted cave. You know, personally, I, I'm pretty sure I'm not alone in this, but I've always uh, preferred the Trident Avenue one. But uh, yeah, it's the Dark Cave. The Dark Cave. If, if this is the Dark Cave, I wonder how dark it's really gonna be, bro. Oh my god, bro. This is crazy. This is crazy, dude. This is even... Hold on, let me turn my brightness up. Yeah, like, this is even darker than the other one, but I still think I prefer the other one, bro. Just because I saw it first, you know, I'm a little bit... I'm a little biased, and also, it has, like, more, like, color. Like, this one is just, like, straight dark and just purple. But, I mean, it's called the Dark Cave, bro. They had to make it darker than Haunted Cave. They had to. They had to. This is really nice. Uh, reminds me especially of uh, the Death School. Like, the last one, uh, the Haunted Cave definitely did. But this one for sure does, you know. Um, my God, this is nice. This is really nice. Did they update Sunken City in the last update? I'm not. I think they did. I don't remember. I'm going to check it in a moment. But this is pretty nice. Um, my rankings are going to have to be Haunted Cave at number one for sure. Trident Avenue number two. Firecat Alley number three, Dark Cave number four, and then Cyclops Lane at number five. But yo, everything looks really nice. My ass almost missed the turn, and I really like what they're doing. Now, again, I like the fact that they're updating uh, a lot of these places, but again, they are kind of just giving us the graphics updates and not much more. Besides this Decalathon thing, I'm gonna have to look into that, but there's not really much. I wish there was more I could check out in this video, but I think we just gotta be patient. Okay, they did update Sunken City. I just don't think I had ever seen it in the video I made on this. Yo, Sunken City is, ooh, uh, this is fresh. This is really fire. I like it. I like this a lot. This might compete with Haunted with uh, the haunted cave but for this update haunted cave definitely wins guys um and yeah honestly i just think we should sit tight for the summer update as well keep in mind this is only the spring update guys this is only spring and so summer is right around the corner they're going to be doing a summer update of course as well like always uh so we should expect that and i'm gonna I'm guess july or august and we should expect some new spells in the summer update because i may if you guys haven't seen my last video it was on uh these polls that they've been making for new spells so we should expect that scoob so i mean i don't know i really think this year is going to be a really good year for wiz last year was a pretty good year they have been getting better uh slowly but surely and hopefully the new dungeon comes out this summer as well new dungeon new spells that would be massive okay massive so um yeah just uh make sure to do all the things i mentioned several times in this video already because i am greasy and other than that i will catch you all in the next one keep it fine uh -huh.